all right then ladies and gentlemen hello and welcome everybody to crypto space guys in today's video we are going to cover a caspa its recent price action of course we are going to look at a caspa's chart and on the top of that we are going to cover a couple of interesting charts for btc and for altcoins as well so guys if you are new to the channel please consider subscribing and a quick disclaimer that this video is not financial advice and now let's hop into the bubbles right away okay so bubbles are actually looking you know green and that is good obviously not everything is pumping at the same time but i'm pretty sure if your portfolio is spread out then you have nothing to be worried about now looking at caspa we are experiencing a little bit of a dip but that's nothing okay we are trading at almost 17 cents the market cap is sitting at 4 billion usd and we are sitting at number 23 now the current reward is 98 caspa next one is going to be 92 the next reduction is scheduled in 24 days we are sitting at 84 percent mined and the hash rate is sitting currently as we speak 400 petahash per second and all-time highs are sitting at 417 petahash per second now guys before we are going to look at other charts let's have a look at caspa first right so caspa you know and cap and handle model right let me actually zoom it in and see you know what happened in let's say last 24 hours so today is 11th and this is what basically happened you know for caspa in these last four in these last 24 hours okay so we had this downtrend right on a four hourly looks like stochastic rsi is going to soon bottom out and after that we potentially could experience something you know bigger okay of course that move in here is caused due to the fact that bitcoin saw a little bit of a pullback okay but that's obviously due to the fact that you know we had some liquidations you know at these levels and i believe that they were grabbed already we saw a little bit of a pullback and now we do have liquidity towards the upside for btc so of course that might pull the price of caspa along with it too now guys i still anticipate this breakout to what 30 cents for for caspa who really knows when exactly is this going to happen nevertheless i believe it will if we are going to look at the daily time frame for caspa we are experiencing that bullish cross for stochastic rsi well we actually have already on 7th of july and now we do have a little bit of a you know downward momentum okay but that's obviously one thing now the target is 30 cents okay so probably funny thing is that many people are going to jump into caspa once caspa is going to achieve those levels right and then they are going to be following into caspa like crazy but nobody is necessarily interested at the moment okay so now let's have a look at the weekly and let's have a look what is going on if it comes to standpoint of the rainbow for our beautiful caspa okay so now guys that level that i'm anticipating 30 cents for caspa would technically be coinciding with that yellow and orange zones okay so that coincides with that nevertheless guys this doesn't look necessarily great i believe on the daily time frame there is going to be a quick pump and then probably something like this okay so if that is going to happen right then we are going to experience something like this and then of course you know everything is still going to go according to the plan my personal humble opinion now guys let's have a look at etf inflows all right so we are sitting at 147.4 million usd if it comes to inflows as of yesterday for btc so we do experience that bullish reversal now if it comes to etf inflows which is obviously great and now guys a little bit of a longer term let me switch this liquidity to monthly and as you guys can see we, we do have significant levels of liquidity in area of 65k for btc and then above that as well okay so guys i'm not saying that btc is going to see huge prices you know after you are going to see that video because that obviously is monthly heat map for the liquidity on binance on its own nevertheless that is a great sign okay now shout out to el crypto pro and this is bitcoin and wyckoff reaccumulation model he's saying that he shared this chart exactly one week ago do you see the similarities now hope you were listening we will see btc back above 60k very soon so first of all we do have to close on a daily above that level okay that's going to be much more bullish confirmation price of btc is following that wake of reaccumulation schematic guys so we've got the creek right that downward momentum that's shaken out many people as we can see in here now we got spring event okay and that bounce could ignite next phase of this cycle okay that is definitely possible of course there are going to be bumps okay as you can see nothing is going to go in a straight line but please remember this is designed for you to be shaken out of the market and sell with loss okay obviously big money don't want 
you know poor people to make money right they don't want retail investors to make gains all right so remember about that and now shout out to the scalping pro and he's saying that after this recent correction bitcoin's weekly rsi is back at the midpoint support and now has much more room to run additionally the famous indicator hash ribbon has been in the capitulation for the past few weeks and a buy signal is imminent guys that is obviously bullish okay rsi is showing that bounce okay so let's see what's going to happen in the next few days and now shout out to titan of crypto and this is ethereum bitcoin chart on a weekly he's saying that ethereum dominance against BTC could be increasing significantly in the coming weeks and bonds which could lead odds to search so guys this is a obviously longer time frame okay every single candle here represents one week so that breakout towards the upside is you know anticipated but you know in foreseeable future and i do believe that this search could be experienced you know going towards the elections okay so patience is going to be rewarded i believe and I would say that probably in my personal humble opinion, of course, not a financial advice, do whatever you want with your money. This is one of the last chances to, you know, degen into the market because, you know, I'm not going to say this when we are going to, you know, see a pump, for instance, right, for Caspa of 300%, okay? That's going to be too late in my opinion, all right? And now let's cover this chart. Shout out to Trader Taring Great, and this is a monthly chart for BTC. He's saying that Bitcoin repeats previous moves. One monthly chart, the current trend line breakout in 2023 is similar to that in 2015. After the breakout in 2015, BTC had a three years bull run. If history repeats, we'll see the top in 2026 and there will be a huge gain in price. Guys, that could be very, very significant, okay? So this is where we are at at the moment, okay? Levels of 60k, 70k, who really cares to be honest? Because obviously we know that Bitcoin is going to see much bigger prices in, let's say, coming months. Well, actually start trading towards the direction, but Trader Taringrade has some crazy predictions of, let's say, 400k for BTC 500. Of course, you know, predictions are very sexy. They sound very cool, but you have to make sure that you have your exit plan strategy, just like your DC seeing into the market you have to make sure that you are DCing out of the market okay because you know maybe you need let's say 300,000 US dollars instead of that 500,000 dollars right and that can obviously get you wrecked if you are going to be greedy so please make sure that you set up your plan and don't be greedy okay because you know the next cycle is going to come anyways and it's definitely to win something rather than nothing now another chart by el crypto pro he's saying that the vast majority of bears wouldn't survive this all year round btc loves inverse head and shoulders patterns daily macd is also turning bullish guys last time we have experienced that inverse head and shoulders okay we had a pump for bitcoin okay so if that target is going to play out of course we could see you know pump and then dump again right and then if we are going to see that okay because again nothing is going to go in a straight line in the market okay make sure that you are DCing in at right moments when everybody's scared okay in my opinion of course this is the best time to buy when people are scared okay now another chart by titan of crypto he's saying that bitcoin is still holding the line btc found support on a red trend line and bounced from it monitor it in the coming weeks guys so last time that happened okay for rsi we saw a pump so now we are trading at these levels again for rsi for btc okay so this could be quite significant all right of course that also happened in 2022 nevertheless after that we saw a bear cycle but still we had some pump towards the upside okay so guys make sure that you're patient okay because we are still holding on that very important support in here and we are also having this support in here which i'm actually going to show you right now so let me go to bitcoin chart and let's actually switch it okay we got it on a weekly so as you guys can see we are still holding this support okay we haven't dipped you know towards that okay but even if we would maximum pain because of course everything might happen right then it's still going to be all right if we are not going to dip below that technical support okay and now guys monthly chart for bitcoin all right and trade the tarring grade is saying that bitcoin fourth post halving rally is coming this is the pattern of btc it happened three times in the history since the beginning it never fails the fourth post halving rally could bring btc to 100k guys that could definitely happen okay so we are going to see how things are going to fly during this cycle okay but 
please make sure that you remember about the fact that you know consolidation around previous all-time highs or slightly below isn't bearish at all okay ladies and gents that's it what i've got for you today i hope that you have guys enjoyed and i wish you having a great day peace and love crypto